Hello, my name is Lars Reime from HK Audio and with this unboxing video I like to present you the new Linear 7 system. But before we start we need a subwoofer here, so let's get one. So here we go with the Linear 7 118 Sub-A and uh, thanks to the really light weight of less than 42 kg uh, it was easy to carry in and now we start to open the box. Here we have a small Linear 7 setup, uh, which consists of the Linear 7 118 Sub-A and uh, the Linear 7 112 FA. So uh, next to the 112 FA, this uh, Linear 7 series also uh, has a, a 115 uh, FA and two monitor uh, speakers um, called 110 XA and 112 XA. Uh, the connectors on the subwoofer we have a power con input, uh, we have a power con link to uh, send out the um, power to another top. We also have um, XLR inputs, we have XLR through to uh, send the signal to a, um, another box. We also have a DSP out and professional Ethercon connectors and last but not least we have a preset knob uh, where we can switch between the four presets directly at the subwoofer. The 112FA also has a power, con, uh, power uh, connector. We have an XLR input and XLR through to send the signal to monitor. We also have a DSP out and two ESACON connectors for network uh, technology. And also, like with the subwoofer, we have a preset knob to switch between four different presets in the box. So, if you compare it to our uh, existing linear uh, portfolio with linear 3 and linear 5, uh, we can see uh, some parts which are really similar, like the front grille of the mid-high unit, and uh, also the dual tilt uh, to place the box on a uh, stand. Uh, but there are some difference and improvements uh, within the Linear 7 series. So, as you can see, we have uh, professional PowerCon and EsaCon uh, connectors. We have an integrated uh, network technology so that we can uh, control all our setup uh, with a network cable. Uh, in addition, we have integrated presets, uh, which we can control via net, uh, network cable or directly at the box. And last but not least, we have this DSP out, which allows me to uh, also connect a non-network DSP box to my DSP network uh, Linear 7 system. After the quick walkthrough through the Linear 7 subwoofer and mid-high unit, uh, we will discuss in upcoming videos uh, the uh, wiring of the system, we will discuss the cardioid mode and also the applications for the Linear 7 lineup. So stay tuned.